Welcome back, welcome back. Yeah. Yeah, family. Man, like I said, first off, before we jump in this video, man, I just want to shout out to all my supporters, man. Everybody who been liking, everybody who been subscribing to the channel, man. Like I said, we at, let see, we at a standstill right now, like I said, but the number's still up, you know what I mean? We still trying to go up, man, on the, on the road to 2K, man. Like I said, I know a lot of people ain't really, like I said, been, let see, uh, just really liking in, like I said, to the last video and everything, but man, we just got the chair and Hitman lit on the ground. Like I said, we still got seven strong pups doing good. I'm going to do a little update video of them later on in the video as well. You know what I mean? But like I said, I just wanted to go ahead and shout out to everybody who, who rocking with me, man. Like I said, the ones who did like that video and the ones who tuned in, the ones who tuned in every video and, and, and still rocking with the movement. You know what I mean? And like I said... And shout out to everybody, like all the new man, new subscribers who came, like I said, who coming in as well, man. Whoever rocking with me, dog men, dog women, you know what I mean. But like I said, man, we having motion out here, man. Got a whole lot going on. If you can see, like I said, I just I put up a new a, a new pen for my chickens and everything, man. Like I said, I had to go and get them them them, them jersey blacks and, and them uh what them red chickens is, you know what I mean? Like I said, I ain't finna get too hung up on the name, but. We had to get them a little cage and everything set up. So we got them out the pen and got them, like I said, they own little coop on the ground, man. I built this out of scrap iron. There's a little wood laying around and, and look, the fence wide out here laying around, you know what I mean? I'm very handy on, you know what I mean, when it comes to just building things, you know what I mean? Like I said, I don't really ever want to go pay somebody to do something that I know I could do, you know what I mean? Like I said, and if you're out here, like I said, you in the country, you, you just dealing with dogs or whatnot. Like I said, you probably want to learn to be hands-on as well. You know what I mean? It'll save you a lot of money and a lot of headache and time. You know what I mean? When you could just build your own little kennels, chicken coops, dog boxes. I, I got a dog box for the pups. I'm going to show y'all as well I built. You know what I mean? And all little, in all little nature, you know what I mean? But like I said, I just want to shout out to everybody who's been showing love, man. Like I said, they're going to be a two-way video. We're gonna run we're gonna do a little rundown up on the bullets, you know what I mean? I'm gonna talk about, you know what I mean, the eyeball, which is this guy of, of his litter, you know what I mean? Like I said, and and, and we're gonna talk about the you see the advantage and the disadvantage of the eyeballs, you know what I mean? And like I said, and give you the rundown on how you deal with it in case you run across that, you know what I mean? This are, these are his siblings right here, you know what I mean? They they come out the same litter, you know what I mean? They came out very, very nice and very sharp, you know what I mean? Nice looking dogs, you know what I mean? And we got this guy right here, he's very nice as, as well. I'm not gonna just sit back and like he's not nice, you know what I mean? But he did come out as small and wide as them, you know what I mean? But he still got a lot of filling out to do. But like I said, he's still nice and you know, he's still a good quality of dog, you know what I mean? But like I said, we're gonna start, like I said, with the advantage of, of the eyeballs, you know what I mean? This from this my take up on it, you know what I mean? I don't get my take, you know what I mean? If if anybody, like I said, who di been dealing with dogs, who, who are a breeder, who deal with dogs, maybe y'all deal with the same sort of nature, you know what I mean? And like I said, y'all can tap in, y'all can deal with it, drop that in the comment section, tell me how y'all deal with it, you know what I mean? But like I said, the, with the eyeballs, you know what I mean? Like I said, with this little owl in itself, you know what I mean? I, like I said, I, I bought a male, you know what I mean? He was a nice male, and he was what I, he he, 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 he had a lot of girth, cause I was looking for girth, you know what I mean? And I was looking for a little color, you know what I mean? And I was looking for structure, you know what I mean? When I bought him, you know what I mean? But I I kind of got catfish with their pops, you know what I mean? Because he was more pocket, like I said, when I got there to get him and everything. But when I, see, when I seen him online, he was, you know what I mean, uh, he was a micro, you know what I mean? Like I said, but they had photoshopped the dog, you know what I mean? And people do that, you know what I mean? Like I said, I don't do no photoshops. So I give the whole rundown clear, like I said, it's there, you know what I mean? For you to know exactly what you get. But like I said, his pops was, like I said, a, a nice pocket meal, you know what I mean? Like I said, he had size up on him, like I said, and the guy, he showed me his pairs and he showed me a few pups, you know what I mean? And they and they was nice looking pups, but you know what I mean? They, they was... Not of my caliber, you know what I mean? But the, he showed me the mom, and the mom, she wasn't my caliber a dog as well either. I, I, so I kind of, you know what I mean, 
put the blame on the mom, you know what I mean? Because I hit Star, you know what I mean? Star Girl, who I want to breed on which at the time, you know what I mean? And I feel like, you know what I mean, I could tie them two in together and give me some nice, nice posts, which I did get a lot of nice posts off that letter, you know what I mean? Like, people are sleeping real hard on this letter, you know what I mean? Because these, these are little mate sisters and brothers, you know what I mean? When I say they, what, what, yeah, what yeah, his brother in the back, back there, he came out nice as well. We don't, we might we get a, we might get around to him as well today. You know what I mean? But I ain't gonna make the video too long. You know what I mean? But like I said, uh, they, they they threw some nice. You know what I mean? Dolls my size. You know what I mean? I, first time I bred them, I got a very very nice male. Like what I mean? I'm talking structure, bone, big dome, short, wide, nice frame and all that. You know what I mean? But she only had one pluck. You know what I mean? And, I, and, he, and he ended up passing up on me. That was my Bought Draco, man. Like I said, if you you follow, if you been following him on the Instagram, you done seen Draco. You know what I mean? He ain't get a chance to reach his peak. He was all black, nice. I'm talking very, very nice male. You know what I mean? But he had a heat stroke on me. You know what I mean? I left him in the sun, bare metal. You know what I mean? He had a heat stroke up on me. You know what I mean? But like I said, these dogs, you gotta be very cautious with them. You know what I mean? Cause they ain't built for that heat. You know what I mean? That's why I keep all of them out here in the, in the, up, in, up in the woods. You know what I mean? Up in the shades. You know what I mean? But like I said, back when I was saying, she had through him, and like I said, he was a very, very nice dog, you know what I mean? So I was like, damn, you know what I mean? He's producing, you know what I mean? But I can't just really tell, you know what I mean? Cause like I said, cause that was the first round batch. I mean, that was the first pet batch of pups I got, well, first pup I got off of him, which it wasn't even a batch of pups. It was a single pup, you know what I mean? But I was like, damn, yeah, I'm liking this, you know what I mean? But I, you see, I end up you see, losing him, and I end up dubbing him back down. And I got this, this lit off of them, which is very nice. I mean, these girls, like I said, if you if anybody looking at lock in, they're gonna have to drop a bag on these girls, you know what I mean? Cause they good tools. You know what I mean? They good to start your camp with, you know what I mean? They good, like I said, to get going. But back what I was saying with this male, like I said, the the, the advantage of, like I said, of these dogs, you know what I mean? You see, the males are like this. They are very, very good producers. You know what I mean? Normally the eye pup out the little, they throw damn good pups. You know what I mean? You just gotta take them to a nice, good, high caliber female. You know what I mean? Like I said, and like I said, well, yeah, well a nice, good caliber female, cause they normally be the better producers, basically what I'm saying. And like I said, and they just, they, they good dogs. You know what I mean? Like I said, they, 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 they pretty much, like I said, they, 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 you know I mean, they might be the eyeball, but sometimes they just, I mean, they just the eyeball. But they normally throw your, your best pup. That's only about one advantage I can have you. But the disadvantage of it, you know what I mean, is like I said, is letting them mature out, you know what I mean? Because I'm pretty sure once he get a little bit older, he gonna be very, very nice, you know what I mean? He gonna still be muscle toned and still look good. He gonna be very nice. But like I said, but the disadvantage of these dogs, you know what I mean, they don't look as good as the rest of the litter, you know what I mean? So you have a problem rehoming them, you know what I mean? Like I said, because, you know what I mean, people don't want to sit back and, and like I said, sometimes trust the blood. Sometimes people just be like, you know what I mean, they want what sells right there and right away, you know what I mean? Which I can't knock it at all, you know what I mean? But I'm just saying, I didn't hear our pups that threw real, real spectacular dogs. And normally be the eye pup. Like I said, that's an advantage as well, you know what I mean? I could throw in there. Normally be the eye pup who be the most best producer, you know what I mean? But like I said, that just... That's just what it is, you know what I mean? But like I said, but the disadvantage, of, like I said, is, man, they, they, you know what I mean, they don't be as good looking as the rest of the little. Some of them, like I said, it, you'll get stuck with them, you know what I mean? Because some people are not just going to want to deal with it, you know what I mean? Or like I said, or just take your word for it, you know what I mean? But like I said, but this guy right here, he's very, very good looking pup, you know what I mean? You can see the frame up on him, he's very, very nice, very structure very muscle tone you know what i mean the only thing i, I mean he need is, is like i said is something to take to you know what i mean with some girth you know what i mean you put some girth on him and a little color up on him behind him i guarantee this dog gonna produce you a hell of a litter you know what i mean but that's just my, my experience and my and like i said i can just give you from what me my perspective from this you know what i mean but like i said but like I said, with these girls, like I said, you know what I mean? She, she's, like I said, a, a very, very nice female, you know what I mean? Like I said, but if I was selling her, you know what I mean? It would be, like I said, I I, I, I dropped up, you see the price, like I, I, I like full tails, you know what I mean? And I and I sell my dogs, like I said, to, for the caliber of dog that I feel that is worth it is, you know what I mean? I'm not finna 
put none of my blood out for cheap peers, you know what I mean? Like I said, I got a great deal going on this guy. Don't get me wrong, you know what I mean? But I'm not finna sell him to a price where I know, you know what I mean? Like I said, I miss out the opportunity to find him his home as well, either, you know what I mean? So I try to stay in between. And like I said, right now, I got, you know what I mean, a few other little something I got in mind that I'm finna be doing regardless anyway, you know what I mean? But like I said, I'm just trying to make a little room before I start dropping some fruit up, uh, some... Uh, uh, some other letters, you know what I mean? So like I said, so, you know what I mean? I got these girls going for a nice deal as well, you know what I mean? Like, but these girls, like I said, I'm not asking nothing, but you know what I mean? 1K for this female that I'm asking, uh, you gonna have to come with at least 1,500 for that girl, you know what I mean? I feel, I'll let her go for 15, you know what I mean? And, come here, hey, come here, girl. Yeah, you might you might have to pay me about fifteen bucks for that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? I mean, come back, I know what I'm working with. You know what I mean? I can't sit back and just and 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 die play the dog. You know what I mean? But these dogs gonna be good too. You know what I mean? Like I say, the tail is nothing. You know what I mean? You can take these dogs to a nice girthy male with color. You know what I mean? And produce you high quality litters every time. And you can range for 25 to 35 off these dogs either. I see dogs, I don't even look nowhere near halfway good as these dogs. You know what I mean? And like I said, they be asking a bag for them. You know what I mean? They ain't just very short. You know what I mean? They still in between. You know what I mean? Especially her. Now, no, I mean, I mean, micro and pocket size. You know what I mean? But this girl right here, you know what I mean? She's micro all day. You know what I mean? Like I said, it's just like I said, and this they sister, you know what I mean? What nasty ass, you know what I mean? So, you know what I mean? You you get high quality dogs the whole four or nine yards, you know what I mean? So, like I said, you got to drop the bag. You, you got to pay the plate, you know what I mean? That I love. And that's what another thing I was going to say about this guy. You can use this guy as a good tool, you know what I mean? He's going to be a damn good producer. Mark my words, you know what I mean? Like I said, you just got to take him to something nice as well, you know what I mean? You can't take him back to some bull, bull crap, you know what I mean, and think you're going to get something nice, you know what I mean? It got to meet up to him, but look at that neck and them shoulder blades on that guy, man. I'm telling you, you know what I mean? He he ain't just no 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 rooted poop, man, you know what I mean? So, he, 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 yeah, he, he going to get you though, you know what I mean? I'm telling you, but like I said... But man, I'm not gonna make this video too long and we finna touch back up on the other end over there, man. Like I wanna show these pups, man. Like I said, I already ran my mouth a little bit too long on her. But like I said, man, y'all just touch back up with me in a minute. All right, we back at it. This is the second part of the video. Gotta excuse me a little bit. It's a little dirty and everything. But yeah, this is the first male that I'm finna be showing off the Hitman and Cherry. Breeding. The pups are almost two weeks of age. This pup right here is the black male. I got four boys and three girls. This is a black male right here. He kind of looked like he was going to have a little brunner specs and he might have a little brunner specs come in down the line because he looked more black as chocolate. You know what I mean? I can't really just pin a point on what color he's going to be right now because he kind of still changing colors. You know what I mean? But this guy very, very nice. Got a nice little eye spread going on him. Nice little face, nice little mug on his face and everything. Yeah. It's the black male. And this right here is gonna be the, the buck skin little girl. She's more buck skin, got like a little brownish dark mask up on her. Some darker ears. And she got like a dark streak in the back, but she gonna be buff skin, red nose for sure. Nice little girl, you know what I mean? Like me and my guy, we splitting this litter, so I don't know yet. Like I said, which ones he gonna pick? But I'm thinking he's gonna pick this girl or, or the chocolate female. You know what I mean? Cause she's three male. I mean three females and four males out there. I like her a lot though, she's real nice. And this guy right here is another unique looking male. He's very creamish brown, he's like a cream peanut butter brown looking color. It's hard to pin a, a color to him right now, you know what I mean? Because he's still changing as the days go by. But I like this guy a whole lot. He's one of the bigger males. 
Yeah, yeah this is very, this is a nice, very little spunky letter as well. You know, what I mean, they already growling. You put your hands up on them, mess with them, and everything. Showing nice, nice little signs of a very, very early age. But like I said, they they too young to be able to tell anything. But you know, what I mean, it hands down, I got no question about this breed. Yeah. And this is my girl right here. Yeah, if everything go good and expect it, you know what I mean, which I'm hoping, you know what I mean, they doing very good as well. This is going to be my keeper female for sure. She got the very, very dark mask around her face, and she got like a reddish color to her coat with, with dark brown uh, chocolate looking brother, you know what I mean. But it's a very, very, very nice, unique girl. I ain't seen no color like this in a very, very long time. I see the red brother, but I ain't never, I ain't, I'm, I'm me personally, I never seen the red brother with the dark brown mask, you know what I mean? That's very unique. I like that. And we got this little chocolate runt. He was another very nice little male, and I like his little eye spread as well. He got a nice little mug on his face. But he the smallest one of the little, but he didn't call it up, you know what I mean? He's definitely gonna be chocolate. He might have some little brunt scraps come in, like I said, cause he's like a few little specks up in there, you know what I mean? That could turn to brunt later down the line. But for right now, he's looking more as chocolate color. The whole little doing good and she's a great mom, you know what I mean? I can't be more satisfied than, you know what I mean, just to, for her to be in her first round. I ain't took not one loss besides the stillborn pup. But these pups are doing very, very good. And this is going to be the, the Hitman twin right here. I mean, my guy looking at him, and like I said, and he like him a lot, and I hope he definitely get him, you know what I mean? Because I got a, a lot of brothers in my yard, but <laughs> if they don't drop the bag, you know what I mean? He definitely going to be sticking around, you know what I mean? If he stick on my end, but I'm hoping my guy get him because... I like him a whole lot. And this this hitman identical twin. He a little bit more lighter, or a little bit more dark. I can't tell because that brother is very tricky. One minute it'll be light, and next minute it'll dark and on up. And like I said, them specks are fall into place. But he got that, 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 that nice look to him. Nice strong stout mouth. Nice nice good scrushy going on with him and everything. And he's the biggest pup out the letter. Yeah, but. Like I said, well, I don't know which one I'm gonna keep, but he don't know which one he gonna grab besides, you know what I mean? The one I already pointed out, that little female girl. Let me see if I can grab. She kinda latched on hard. But this is the little chocolate female. She looked just like the male, you know what I mean? Got a nice little look up on him, you know what I mean? He look a little bit more <laughs> vicious than what she looks, but she's very nice as well. Got a nice frame. Same, almost identical. Nice brunner coat. And y'all excuse my Christmas tree in the back, you know what I mean? I ain't got around to taking it down today. But yeah, this is the female. This is the third female off the letter. And my guy, he gonna either pick the, you see, the, the buckskin female or this one. And whichever one he don't pick, gonna stay on the, on the, with, on, with the count. You know what I mean? Because I'm looking for more females off this letter. But I might keep one of the bars, you know what I mean? If people don't come and get their mind right and drop their bag up on them. You know what I mean? But it's a very, very nice letter. Very scream letter. Very high quality letter. And I'm very satisfied. Well, that's all for today. So y'all got the update, and y'all got a chance to see me talk about the bullets. So we finna get out of here.